Moving on, we talked a little bit yesterday about former Red Hot Chili Peppers guitarist Josh Klinghoffer, uh, who lately has been uh, doing guitar live uh, with Pearl Jam. He's been touring with them. He was set to be arraigned on Thursday for his car accident back in March uh, in California, in which he struck 47-year-old pedestrian Israel Sanchez at a crosswalk with Sanchez uh, unfortunately passing away later that day due to injuries sustained from the accident. And Klinghoffer was, in fact, arraigned on Thursday he did not attend, but he entered a not guilty plea through his lawyer, uh, Blair Burke, to a misdemeanor charge for vehicular manslaughter with gross negligence. Which is pretty much exactly what we expected because Deadline reported on Wednesday that Klinghoffer was expected to be arraigned uh, yesterday, Thursday, uh, on a misdemeanor charge in connection with the accident back in March. So we already went over the uh, backstory of the accident. I'll play footage from that incident right now. And uh, Sanchez's daughter, Ashley, filed a civil suit against Klinghoffer back in July, uh, seeking a jury trial and damages for the funeral, uh, burial, all that, as well as medical costs, attorney fees, pain, and the loss of, quote, love, companionship, comfort, care, assistance, protection, affection, society, and moral support. The suit then goes on to say, video of the incident shows that defendant Klinghoffer made no efforts to break or slow down until after he fatally struck Mr. Sanchez, indicating that Klinghoffer was likely to be driving while distracted. Video taken seconds before the incident shows an object between the steering wheel and the driver that is believed to be a phone. Klinghoffer's legal team, of course, denies the allegation of a distraction, calling it nothing more than a purely tragic accident. In a statement to KTLA 5 News, Klinghoffer's attorney, Andrew Brettler, said, It's clear from the evidence that Mr. Klinghoffer was not on the phone at the time of the accident. This was a tragic accident. There was no criminal intent, nor is any alleged.